Energy. Energy refers to the ability to do work or generate heat. Energy is conserved and can be converted from one form to another, but it cannot be created or destroyed. There are various types of energy, typically classified as follows. Mechanical energy, energy associated with the position or motion of objects. Examples include potential energy, kinetic energy, and elastic energy. Thermal energy, energy related to the temperature of an object. The higher the temperature of an object, the more thermal energy it possesses. Electric energy, energy associated with electric and magnetic fields. Electric energy is used to power lights or operate electronic devices. Chemical energy, energy associated with chemical bonds. Chemical energy is used in processes such as digesting food or moving automobiles. Nuclear energy, energy associated with nuclear fission or fusion. Nuclear energy is used to produce electricity in nuclear power plants. Light energy, energy associated with light. Light energy comes from sources such as sunlight, fluorescent lamps, and candles. Sound energy, energy associated with sound. Sound energy comes from sources such as music, speech, and mechanical noise. Enthalpy. Enthalpy is defined as the internal energy plus the product of pressure and volume work. Enthalpy is represented by H and is calculated as follows. H equals U plus PV. Where? H is enthalpy, J. U is internal energy, J. P is pressure, Pa. V is volume, cubic meter. Enthalpy represents the amount of heat gained or lost by a system at constant pressure. For example, when water is boiled, it absorbs heat, increasing its enthalpy. Conversely, when water evaporates, it releases heat, decreasing its enthalpy. Entropy. Entropy is a physical quantity that represents the degree of disorder in the system. Entropy is denoted by S and is defined by the second law of thermodynamics. The second law of thermodynamics states that the entropy of a closed system either increases with time or remains constant. As entropy increases, the system becomes more disordered, while as entropy decreases, the system becomes more orderly. For example, ice has a crystalline structure, resulting in low entropy. However, when ice melts and becomes water, the molecules can move more freely, leading to an increase in entropy. Entropy and enthalpy are important concepts in thermodynamics. Enthalpy represents the energy changes in a system, while entropy represents the changes in disorder of the system. Types of energy in thermodynamics In thermodynamics, energy can be broadly categorized into kinetic energy, potential energy, internal energy, and flow energy. 1. Kinetic energy Energy resulting from the motion of an object. It is determined by the mass and velocity of the object. Formula, K equals half mv squared. Examples, moving car, thrown ball, falling object. 2. Potential energy. Energy associated with the position of an object. It depends on the object's position and the forces acting on it. Examples. Gravitational potential energy, object at a height, compressed spring. Elastic potential energy, stretched rubber band, compressed spring. Electric potential energy, charged object. 3. Internal energy. Energy generated by the motion and position of molecules or atoms within a system. It is influenced by factors such as temperature, chemical bonds, and molecular vibrations. Examples. Thermal energy, increase in temperature of water. Chemical energy, chemical bonds of fuel. Nuclear energy, nuclear fission or fusion. 4. Flow energy. Energy generated by the flow of a fluid. It depends on the velocity and density of the fluid. Formula, K equals half rho V squared. Examples, flowing river, wind, moving liquid. Inner conversion between different types of energy. Kinetic energy can be converted into potential energy and internal energy. For example, a falling object experiences a decrease in potential energy and an increase in kinetic energy, while friction increases internal energy. Potential energy can be converted into kinetic energy and internal energy. For example, an object at a height loses potential energy as it falls, gaining kinetic energy, while friction increases internal energy. Internal energy can be converted into kinetic energy and potential energy. For example, when water boils, internal energy increases, leading to the conversion of kinetic energy, movement of steam, and potential energy, rise of steam. Flow energy can be converted into kinetic energy and internal energy, and kinetic energy and potential energy can be converted into flow energy.
The first law of thermodynamics applies the principle of energy conservation to thermodynamic systems, stating that in a closed system, energy may change forms but the total energy remains constant.